And it is time for our X Division title matchup. Pretty obvious when you look at the statistics, the experience edge goes to Jerry Lynn. No question that these are the fiercest rivals of wrestling's hottest division. Can Jerry Lynn win back the title belt that he never lost in the ring? That's the question that we're ready to answer. The following contest is your main event of the evening and is scheduled for one fall with a 60 minute time limit. Making his way to the ring, he is the challenger. Weighing in at 212 pounds from Minneapolis, Minnesota, Jerry. defend his X Division title against AJ Styles. Lynn lost his focus. He attacked Sonny Siaki. He re-injured his right knee in the process. Jerry Lynn was promised an eventual shot at the X title. Tonight, he gets a chance to regain the championship that he lost without being pinned or submitting. And his opponent, he is the current reigning and defending NWA X Division champion of the world, being accompanied by Mortimer Plumtree from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 212 pounds. This is the phenomenal AJ Styles. In the five-month history of NWA TNA, this man, AJ Styles, and we saw him accompanied by his manager, Mortimer Plumtree, and tonight's opponent, Jerry Lynn, have been involved in the most heated, the most competitive rivalry to date. It began back in June when the two made it to the finals of our X Division Championship Round Robin Tournament. And it continues tonight with the latest chapter, and it still revolves around the X Division title. I'll tell you what, folks, there is a lot of heat between these two. They have disliked each other for a long, long time. I, for one, am glad to see them back in the ring. But although, I'll tell you this, AJ Styles is lucky to be in that ring tonight because last week, the Amazing Red put on one of the greatest shows we ever saw and almost beat the champion. And we're going to get to see him back next week, Mike. Yeah, we have to mention Amazing Red and the incredible matchup as he came so close on so many occasions last Wednesday to winning that X Division title from AJ Styles and Red will return one week from tonight right here on NWA TNA. You know, when I look at this matchup, I almost think that Mortimer Plumtree is the X Factor because in the previous bouts between these two, Jerry Lynn has been able to totally concentrate on AJ Styles. That's not the case tonight. Lynn has to keep at least one eye on Plumtree and that has to take away his effectiveness against Styles. Well, Mike, I also want to tell you what else is going through Jerry Lynn's mind. He lost his shot for an NWA title last week to Siaki. Well, this is the only title left. He's going for it. I don't think he's going to let Plumtree interfere. He'll keep him in the, in the back of his mind. He'll keep an eye on him, but he's focused. He wants AJ Styles, and he wants his belt back, Mike. And we talked about Amazing Red returning next week. Consider this the winner of this matchup. Whoever either retains the title or wins the title, whether it's Styles the champion or Lynn the champion at the conclusion of this match, they will defend next week against Kid Cash, who earlier tonight won that tables elimination match to gain a shot at the X Division belt. And a lot of people have felt that Kid Cash deserved a title shot a long time ago. Well, it takes patience in the X Division, but he earned it. He earned it today by beating four formidable opponents, and next week he'll take on the winner of this match in another incredible X Division title match. That's why you've got to be here every Wednesday night, Mike, because you see the greatest wrestling you've ever seen, period. Jimmy Yang of the Flying Elvises returns one week from tonight, returns to the X Division. And I understand that there's a debut as well in the X Division next week, Easy Money, a wrestler that you're going to be pretty impressed with. I saw him for several months in World Championship Wrestling. He debuts one week from tonight, and he will be a great addition to the NWA TNA X Division. Remember that name, Easy Money, debuts next Wednesday. The two are just sizing each other up right now. They both know that either one can explode at any moment, everywhere. Both of them have death-defying moves, like it showed in that clip, gravity-defying moves. And what you have to do right now is just pick their spot and 
because once it gets going, Mike, there'll be no stopping this or whirlwind. Yeah, early stages of this matchup, sort of a feeling out process between the two. Both men tentative. Both men not wanting to expose too much of their offense until they've worn their opponent down. You know, it's been a while since the two of them have been in the ring. They've, they've faced so many different opponents, too. You know, you've got to refamiliarize yourself with the other opponent. Lynn coming off the ropes, attempted a hip toss. Caught him with a knee, floats over, ducks the clothesline, drops down, sweeps the leg. Look at that, went for the elbow. They are one step ahead of each other is what you're seeing here with each and every move in the arm drag. Surprise Styles. I'll tell you what, nobody knows each other in the ring like these two do, Mike. Phenomenal chain wrestling by both of these individuals, trying to put moves together, but at the same time, each one, as you mentioned, they know each other so well, they are refamiliarizing themselves with each other, and they seem to be just one step ahead of the other, knowing what move they're gonna make. The only time that Jerry Lynn has ever lost in an X Division title bout was when there was no X Division champion. That, when it, we crowned the champion. When we crowned the champion. Other than that, when Jerry Lynn became champion later, the only way he lost was a three-man match where the other person took it. So, like you said, he has never lost the next division title once he's been champion. Styles swinging wildly in the corner, doesn't connect, and that allows Lynn to turn the tide. And neither is AJ. Yep, yeah, yeah, great point. Both these two, these are the two best. These are the two best. Springing off the middle rope, flying cross body. Leg sweep now by Styles for the cover. If you have to give out an MVP award, you're looking at the two co MVPs. Styles to his feet and immediately taken down to the mat with the running clothesline by Lynn. Lateral press, barely a two count. Just wear, trying to wear each other down, feeling each other out here. Looking for that opportunity where you can go for it in one quick shot because with these two, you cannot let the other stay in. You've got to finish them when you can. Can't hold back. Jerry Lynn using the side headlock to attempt to wear down Styles, but you'll notice that Styles fights back and then went for the shortcut, went for the rake of the eyes. You know, this is a match hit. Oh man, here it goes! Yo! Jerry Lynn just took it over to Stanley! No! Tilt a whirl backbreaker by Lynn! I've got to see that again! Shot. Can you right. ask for it? Keith Mitchell, can you produce the replay? Sorry, folks, we are not able to bring you the replay back to the live action. Bow and arrow type submission hold applied by Lynn. Pressure is on the neck as well as the lower back. Floored over by Styles, and he almost got a two count. Lynn immediately gets to his feet and drives the boot right into the chest of Styles. You just knew something was going to happen in a big way, and I, I hope, here we are, we're gonna show that. Split screen up into the air, the tilt of world. <laughs> Winds him up, drives him down with authority across the knee. Oh, I love total non-stop action. And you've gotta love the X Division to the ropes, the reversal now, Styles sent in. Another one, oh! was going for a flying head scissors takeover. Lynn able to block it, drive him down to the mat, and immediately go for the pin. Unbelievable. How these two perform night in, night out. Whenever they show up, whoever their opponent, they come back seemingly so many times when it looks like they're down and out. It's over, they're done. And yet they'll find something else. Question that the resiliency of these X Division athletes almost separates them from the pack into the corner. The knife edge chop and the open hand slap is the follow up from Lynn. Unbelievable right here. Reversed off, sends him diagonally into the corner, does Styles. Lynn able to elevate him to the ring apron. At this point, Jerry Lynn has had the advantage. If anybody had a beautiful move, Springing into the air, Jerry Lynn connecting with the drum kick. Styles to the floor. Coventry realizes that his man and his championship belt is in jeopardy.
property. Oh, man. Think about it. If Jerry Ned wins tonight, Warmer Plumtree has suffered a double defeat. A steal went out first in the five-man elimination, table elimination match, and then losing the title with AJ. That might be too much for even Plumtree to handle. And you know that Plumtree loves to have that X Division championship belt in his stable. He realizes that with the title belt, he has all the power. That's the reason why he wanted to take over the entire X Division, and you cannot knock his success to this point. Taking it out right. Oh! Look at that. He went for the shoulder block. And again, oh! they're one step ahead of each other with every move. The leg sweep by Lynn connects and takes Styles down to the floor. From what I'm seeing, though, from my vantage point right here, Mike, Jerry Lynn is still outsmarting AJ just a little bit more. He's using that fast 14 year experience. But you better finish AJ Styles off quick because he is such a phenomenal athlete. Face first goes Stein, right into the ring steps, the steel steps. I mean, we thought Amazing Red had him last week, and Styles came back from nowhere and won the match. You cannot count him out. Whoa. He just jumped right over the steel rail to avoid the contact, and as soon as he exposed his head, AJ Styles planted a super kick right on the jaw. That's the athleticism I'm talking about, Mike. Did you see that? He could have easily went in the rail. He saw it coming. He blocked it. Look at this. Look at this. Oh, man. And then look at this. As soon as Lynn was caught in no man's land, Styles was there with the follow-up move. And when Moses couldn't have leaped over the hurdle any better than that. Back to our live action and this X Division title matchup. AJ Styles trying to catch his breath, which you need to. Again, these two are all, oh! <laughs> Went for a springboard off the guardrail. Lynn was there, Lynn was ready, he was prepared, and he caught Styles in midair. Both men are down. Jerry Lynn trying to avoid losing a chance at a title in two straight weeks. Oh, beautiful kick by Jerry Lynn on the replay, as you saw. That would be devastating to Lynn. Both of these competitors trying to fight their way back up just to get back into the ring. Look how even they've been this entire match, even to the point here where they both climb into the ring at the exact same time. AJ Styles, the only two-time X Division champion, has held the championship longer, has held the belt longer than any other X Division member. And he's only been at it for four years. The exchange of punches, Lynn winds up, connects with a big right hand that sends Styles right through the ring ropes. The crowd of, you know, it's, it's amazing. The crowd is almost evenly divided. Jerry Lynn, a huge crowd favorite, but AJ Styles is one of those that, you know, love him or hate him, you respect his ability so much that you find yourself rooting for him. Wait, 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 look at Plumtree. Oh, come on. We talked about him being the X Factor in this matchup. We don't need this. Two cheap shots from yeah. Plumtree. Yeah, Plumtree, sit down over there. Oh, when you got these two out there in the ring, you don't need any outside yeah, interference. Especially from Plumtree to spoil what has been a tremendous matchup between these two to this point. Well, his title's on the line. Yeah, Plumtree's title as well as That's AJ's right. if you talk to him. That's right. Baseball slide, drop kick by Styles was right on target. Down goes Lynn. Rudy Charles back in control of the match there, referee Rudy Charles. You cannot. Oh, man! Slingshot into the crossbody block. AJ Styles goes airborne. But AJ Styles crashes down on the Lynn. I don't know if there's a chance to see that, but if you'll notice, AJ grabbed his midsection. Watch this. Watch where it hits. Look at this. Boom! It's a midsection. You got the top of Jerry Lynn's head right there. Yeah, his there. head and his shoulder. And that no, can take the wind right out of you. It's almost like hitting him in the, in the solar plexus right there. And rolls it back in. Here it is. It's two. No. Not yet, says Jerry Lynn. That's what's at stake, ladies and gentlemen. You better believe the X it. The X-Division Championship belt. But even more than that's at stake. It's, it's to say you are the champion in the number one division in wrestling. Oh, my gosh. Did 
Jerry Lynn just flip him over like that. It's the title belt, and it's the pride that goes with saying that you're the best, especially between these two competitors, That's as right. you mentioned. Going to try and take him up. Attempt at the pile driver. Oh. Styles uses his strength to elevate Lynn. And then comes back with a desperation lunge that ends in a clothesline. I can't help but feel that if Jerry Lynn's going to win this match, he's got to do it real quick. And here it goes. Two. Oh, man. He's got to do it quick because the youth of AJ Styles will come into play. And he is such an incredible athlete. And ask Amazing Red, you've got to put AJ Styles out where you can. Can't give him any life. Submission attempt now applied by Styles. He has the cross face applied. He's got the arm hook, and he has Lynn in trouble because of the ring positioning. There's nowhere for Jerry Lynn to go. Fighting it off. Refusing to tap out is Lynn, and Styles just throws him down to the mat. I'll tell you something, folks. There is no love lost between these two. They make no bones about it. They are not friends. They are not friends in any Styles sense of the word. Here it is. Got... Oh, wait a minute. He went for the Styles Clash. Lynn was able to avoid the Styles Clash by sliding through. But they take this music right to his advantage to put the submission hold right on him. AJ Styles ends up with oh. a unique version. You see of that? The Crab trying to lean back with his weight on the lower back of Jerry Lynn. Did you see? Jerry Lynn was close to grabbing the ropes, and AJ just moved him right back to the center of the ring. I think you're also seeing some frustration here on the part of AJ Styles. What's he got to do? Yeah, he's figured is in his own mind that he's had Lynn hooked. He's had him beaten several times. Lynn will not submit. Too much fight in Jerry Lynn. Oh, these two. You talk about a clash of the titans. That's what you're looking at right here. Mid-ring exchange, duck the second kick, Styles ducks the clothesline, precarious position. <laughs> Styles went for the hurricane line. Here we go! Here it is! Plum tree on this! Again. This is plum tree. And believe me, this is by design. But you know what? Look at how the veteran Jerry, he knew he was going to get it. He knew the referee wasn't watching, so he just went back, got it started again. Well, the low blow by Styles. Spring oh. back, inverted DDT, drops Lynn down. Now the cover, now one, one now two. Oh. Little shoulder up by Lynn. He He's fights still it in out. this match. Let's see this again. Phenomenal balance. Look in, at how he just... in mid-move, able to connect, hook him with the inverted DDT, how and does... drop him down to the mat. How, how does, does he do he it? Land that... on his feet? It's the question we ask about these X Division competitors each and every week, every Wednesday here on NWA TNA. Moonsaults back off the chest oh. of Lynn, and then walks right into a right hand, and Lynn walks right into the back elbow. There it goes. Oh. Out of the corner. Oh. Oh. But he can't cover him. No, he's too, he's too spent. AJ has taken the life out of him. Jerry Lynn used all of his strength to deliver that power bomb. As we take another look while the competitors try and regroup. Oh. He folded how him do, up. How do these people get up, period? Let alone come back and, and, and give another effort in a, a week later. I don't know how. They're that. Highly trained in that physically conditioned. Again, look how close they are, how evenly matched. They both get up to a knee at the same time, and they both get to their feet at the same time. To the ropes, no style. Oh, man. Back body drop by Lynn. Follow up with the running clothesline. He just hit his second lariat. He also hit his second wind, it looks like. Look at him. Challenging Styles to get to his feet. He's keeping him over there away from Plumtree. Well, over to the corner. Lynn goes chest first. Attempt. Look at that. Oh, man. Beautiful move by Jerry Lynn right there. Attempt at the DDT by Styles. Reverse with a quick snap. Here we go. One, two. Oh, wait a minute. Get down up there. Get down. We do not have a new champion. Let's see what happened here. Well, here's the replay of first the move of the DDT. And then the quick toss off as we see back in live action. Whoa, Styles almost nailed Plum Tree. Oh, beautiful! Meeting the right. Boot to the middle. He's got a run. Here we go. Bam, bam, there it is. Dropped him with the two. One, stone. two. No, no, you've got to be kidding. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Siaki.
What's Sonny Siaki doing up the ramp? Not him. We don't need him to spoil this. Unbelievable. He had him in the pile driver, but he was able to kick out. Fireman's carry. Styles is Stunner type move. One, two. Wait a minute. Siaki pulled him out. He, oh, oh God, that was over. Jerry Lynn had it. And Siaki came in, of course, again. Right now, you talk about being surrounded by enemies. Jerry Lynn surrounded by AJ Styles, who's had a, a heated rivalry for for months. Sunday Siaki, Mortimer Country. Take back Siaki, cost Lynn the NWA title. And he just, he may have cost him the X Division title. Plumtree's just wedged a steel chair between the top and middle ropes. Oh, man. Jerry Lynn, I feel like he's just being double teamed up. Oh, man. The drop toe hole for AJ Styles sends Jerry Lynn face first into that chair. Oh, no. Oh, the wait, no ref there's no referee. So now AJ. Oh, wait a minute. Plumtree. One, two. Oh, he pulled out. Only two. Styles clash again. Oh. oh no. Here we go. One, two. Oh, he, did. he didn't use his proper weight positioning to pin him. He thought after the Styles clash that a win was going to be easy, that a pin was going to be easy, but it wasn't. Lynn kicked out a two. How many lives does Jerry Lynn have? Not enough, Mike, but what a valiant effort. Styles to the top. Oh. By Lynn. What an unbelievable match. Jerry Lynn, almost in a three on one when you throw in Plumtree and then Siaki, but Siaki's gone, so. Attempted the superplex. Oh, oh man. Lynn just hit the superplex. Here we go. One, one two. two. No. Damn, only two. How does AJ Styles do it? How does Jerry Lynn do it? Now, Lynn's gonna try and take him up into the air. Styles blocks it. Has him up. Oh. Oh. Drives him to the mat face first. One, Left two. two, for two for no. Again, only two. Ladies and gentlemen, an incredible series of near falls in this X Division title matchup has the crowd at the TNA Asylum on their feet. They appreciate the effort of these two individuals. How can you not? Lynn amazingly lands on his feet. Counter, Look at this. Countered by Styles. And a counter by Lynn in mid move. Pile driver. Oh, again. Charts again.